All right, coming up next, it is our main event, a matchup for the UFC Women's Bantamweight title. All right, here's the number one women's Bantamweight contender. She believes for a while she's been... So here she is, the undisputed UFC with off the low wings in the back. She's been the best 135er in the world now for some time. Another 35. You ready? Are you ready? Long one! All right, here we go with round one. The classically trained striker versus the Brazilian jiu-jitsu black belt. And a lot of people believe if she can get off with the hands here early, it could be a quick night at the office. Yes, yeah, she has to use her hands. She has to be fast and has to really make a point to not be kicking too much. Oh, big knee! a diverse striker that that big strike landed and it looks like she's gonna finish this fight. She missed with that jab. Nice, nice kick. That one landed clean. She slips that left hand there. Big leg kick land. There she goes landing that jab again. She might have a better jab than you do. Oh, she's got a fantastic jab. I'm telling you, put me to, put me to shame. I like to try to fight behind my jab, but I'm not sure I've ever landed him so consistently as we've seen her do tonight. Oh! And this might just be a matter of time. Great movement by her here on the ground, and she just does it so fluidly and so easily. It, it's really a sight to behold. You can tell that she spent a lifetime developing this skill with the way that she's able to move with so little effort on the mat. Well, you gotta stay busy from the bottom position. Can't falter here, she's doing a nice job. All right, half guard position for her here, and this is a spot where we've seen her have a lot of wild success in previous fights. She has a tremendous amount of success with this position because she's so knowledgeable. Three she keeps left. the right side underhook, and she just goes to work with that left arm. She's posting an elbow. She's building her posture and punching. There are just so many different ways for her to score strikes from this position. All right, full guard now, DC. She's on the bottom. What is she trying to do? Well, she's got to throw up submissions to try to put her opponent on awareness. And these submissions will be used to reverse the position. Even if it gets defended, it will create space for her to try to get back to her feet or maybe to steal a sweep and trick her opponent. Submission defense there. Big punch lands through the middle. Nice one, two there. Now this could be the beginning of the end for her home. It seems like we are in the final act of a four-part play because this fight is about done. I mean, look at the commitment kicking in this fight. Oh, wow, those leg kicks are already taking effect. Take her down! Just missed with the left there. Oh, and she just continues to land that jab, keeping her opponent at distance. She's making this look like a video game. I mean, she's making it look like a video game. It's unreal to watch her pop that jab. It's like you're watching a J-check before her. Fast moving. Jab always started everything, and tonight, this young lady is employing that same strategy. Well, 
Raquel back to her feet here, but man, is she hurt. How about that, Shen? Again, back into his position. She did not miss a single grappling practice. Oh! She is, so the submission attempt right at the end of the round, saved by the bell, back to the stools they go. We'll see if she can recover in time for this next round. All right, so that's the end of the round. Lot to like in there, DC, particularly when it comes to her offensive wrestling. She's evolving, right? She's gotten better. Get out there. Let's relax. Excellent work. All those rounds on the pads in the gym have paid off. Now we're going to continue. Keep doing exactly what you're doing. Are you ready? No. level I've got to get the knockout win here tonight mission accomplished we now go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision ladies and gentlemen referee Ian Levin is going to stop in this contest at 28 seconds round number two 